So welcome to our beautiful Your Town Fires home at Sanctuary Grove in Budgeon. This is one of two offers that the winner gets to choose from in your town prize home draw 505. So first prize value, $1.83 million. Come and have a look at this beautiful Hampton home. So we'll head straight down into the living and kitchen space here. Check out that vista. Now, of course, the heart of the home, always the kitchen, absolutely beautiful. Now, this kitchen is huge. I'm not much of a cook. Some people might have picked that up. But this is an entertainer's and a chef's dream. This kitchen has two of everything. So there's two dishwashers, one here and one here. Then we also have two bins. So if you're working up this end, you've got your dishwasher and your bin space. Of course, connection to your nice big porcelain sink here. This is beautiful too, this pattern on the sink. And I really like this feature. You've got a draining area here. It's a Villa Rome Bosch sink. You've got your little um, catchers here. And then this space here for all of your sponges and those sorts of things. And over here, you've got the same thing. So another dishwasher and another bin area, which is cool. So obviously all of your drawers, storage all along here, all of your instruction manuals and everything in there, storage again, all up here, it's absolutely huge space. Massive induction cooktop, really nice big oven, so smeg appliances in the main part of the kitchen here. And then um, we have your butler's pantry here. Have a fridge here. Now, this fridge also has a drink section that you can open separately at the front, and then obviously a freezer section. Now, in the butler's pantry, I told you two of everything, there's another oven. So you've got a Bosch oven in here, there is a microwave that is also a convection oven, and of course a second fridge, because like, you need two fridges if you're going to entertain, right? Great workspace. Now that's only limited to 500,000 tickets. Tickets are only $15 each and we draw on the 16th of April. So don't miss out on this one. It's incredible. So that is the kitchen. Now for this beautiful indoor living space, the indoor fireplace that we've talked about. So that is a gas fireplace. So heats up and gets started pretty much straight away. And then you have this great door that opens right up. Our fresco dining at its very best. We have the pool access just here. It's great having a pool there, able to be a feature for the whole home. And then your outdoor fridge for beverages. Nice big barbecue. Great tub dining space for six people here. Looking out onto that spectacular view over there. So nice, you can hear the birds. So access to the pool just here. And then looking back into that gorgeous space there. So nice. Okay, back down the hallway here. We have a powder room just here. Cleverly popped in there under the stairs. Then there is storage here also, which is a nice big storage space on the stairs. There's even a light there so you can access that at night time when it's dark. Okay, now let's check out the master suite. I love this room. What is not to love? It looks out over that beautiful pool. It's a nice water feature. Then we have this great four poster bed. Now, ensuite and his and her robes. So you've got access to, let's call it the gentleman side. So loads and loads of space, drawers, hanging space. You've also got um, nice shelving there as well. 
and then on the other side over here you have the other nice walk-in robe and this would do me nicely let's face it both would do me quite nicely and then we have this beautiful ensuite in here nice large ensuite huge shower you've got your rain shower as well as your handheld double basins lots of storage again which is great and that is the master so air conditioned and ceiling fans which is fantastic and then let's check out upstairs so i love this huge ceiling and a floor ceiling glass it lets in so much light into the entire space now this is one of my favorite parts of this house the quintessential home office now what a work from home space this would be can accommodate a couple of people or can also accommodate the kids and this gorgeous outlook outside all you can see from this space is trees now what i love about this adjoining space as well is that this provides you with a second living area but at the same time it's like a breakout living space for your work from home office. So nice big TV there. And then you've got another little writing desk here if you want to create a space for children with computers. So there's four bedrooms up here in total, one large main bathroom and three out of the bedrooms are en suite. So I've got shutters in all of the rooms, air conditioning and ceiling fans. This particular room has built-in robe. Absolutely massive bathroom. So huge shower, beautiful bath, double vanities and loads of storage again in that space. Okay, now we have another gorgeous bedroom. This one has a little built-in study nook as well, which is great. And again, lots of space in the built-in room. So again, ceiling fan in here as well. Now this bedroom is a really great size. Um, beautiful outlook there onto the trees again, to the reserve. Got your built-in robes, and this is one of the bedrooms that has an ensuite. So some nice underbench lighting there. And again, your rain shower and your handheld shower. Really great sized ensuite. Then from here, we have another bedroom that is ensuite, but again, nice size. Looking out into those trees, air conditioning and ceiling fans, and then a really great size ensuite in here as well. Your rain shower, your hand the shower. So you are spoilt for bedroom and bathroom choices in this home. Again, lots of space in the robes there. This one has so much storage. So more storage here. And here is a laundry chute that goes from the upstairs area to downstairs. We'll show you where that comes out when we hit the downstairs section of the laundry. And just a, a one more take of, across here as we go downstairs. All of this storage here in your home office which is fantastic. That whole wall there is a bank of cupboards with storage. Perfect. I would work from home here any day. Okay, let's check out downstairs. Okay, now for the other wing of the home. Okay, here, now I showed you that laundry chute upstairs before. Here is where it comes out. So nice and convenient with your laundry right there. We'll show you that in a minute, but have a look at this. Meet your own. 
Now this is on a lot of people's bucket list. Now this, I was just playing with these a little bit earlier. Now check this out. So you can really get truly comfortable in your cinema room. So it's leveled so that everybody gets to see whatever's happening on that massive television set right there. Now, huge, absolutely huge laundry space here. So I've got your uh, single top here, storage under there, washer and dryer. Again, all of this along here is storage. We've even got a little laundry hamper there for you to collect the things out of the chute. More storage here, and again, still more storage. And you can actually access the outside area here. We'll show you that shortly when we come back through the garage. Nothing but storage. There's a hanging rail right under here, so you can also hang uh, right across there your shirts when they're drying. And I, this is a feature I love, but a lot of houses don't have it, a wet room. On a property, you might call it a mud room, but wet room means that you can hang up coats, wet sports gear, school bags, going away bags, overnight bags, and then you're nice and close to the laundry to be able to wash that through. Now the garage, one of the great things about this house is you actually have a three car garage or space for two cars and a boat or a caravan. And then this section here, this gives you separate access to this section of the garage and there's full storage space here where if it was your thing and you wanted to set up a, uh, a workbench tool area, you certainly could do that. There's side access down the house here from the front. And then around this section here, you have your clothesline that you can also access from the laundry door that's right here. So there you go. I hope you have enjoyed our tour of this beautiful home in Sanctuary Grove at uh, Budrum on the Sunshine Coast. Keep an eye out for our tour of Surrey Hills in Sydney. We'll be bringing that to you very soon. Thank you and good luck.